Georgetown did fire head coach John Thompson. And here comes Patrick third. Ewing. Which would be nice. As much as I Agreed. hate Georgetown, I love Patrick, and that guy, does, if he wants it, that, that should be a no-brainer. Give him the gig. Uh, deserves a head coaching job, and assuming he wants to deal with the, the, the bull crap of recruiting and all that stuff, uh, well, you know, why not? And then, you know what you do? You, you go get Alan Iverson, who played for you, and if you're a kid looking to play uh, serious basketball, and Patrick Ewing and Alan Iverson walk in your front door, you got a pretty good chance of getting that You're kid. recruiting everybody. Just saying. No, I'm. I'm I don't know you. why more. I, I don't know if Maryland does that or or if uh, your broadcasting school did it, Jerry. But we if, did not. We didn't have a team. If you're going to recruit, no. like I would get the most iconic representative players of that school that everyone would know, you know, the Hall of Fame types, and I would use them to recruit. Yeah. Have I to, don't think you can. Yeah, I, I, why not? No, no, you can't. You can't do it. I mean, it's against the NCAA rules. You've got to be Ju very careful about how you do this. You can't go to the fort with a graduate? Why not? Uh, you you got to be very careful about how you do these things. Nah, you do it anyway. Yeah. Well, that's why if you have them Jim on staff. Jim Harbaugh's doing it. That, the, Jim Harbaugh is the case study of, a, of an alum going back to take over a university that's in dire straits and turning it around literally within two years. Well, if, if he had a good quarterback, he would have won two national championships. But the point being is that he himself is it all in? Is all in, and basically, I mean, I'd love to see Patrick do that, but I don't know if he wants to do that. I think he may just want to stay in the NBA. You know, the chance to be the man and be the head it's a coach. Lot of work. But there's one thing about the, co he, the college game that you have to understand. He can teach the game. I'm not worried about that. But it's just all the other stuff right. around the game. The fundraising and the it's recruiting. It's the fundraising. It's yeah. the deal. You know, he's a, he's a Hall of Fame, so one of the 100 a, greatest you, players you of all Mullen time. Did, you know, Mullen's got four great recruiters around him. He's also got a Hall of Famer on his staff named uh, what? Mitch, Mitch Richmond. And he did it the right way.